Well, I didn't get many pictures there or much video, but that's where we anchored last night at the Dismal Swamp Visitor Center. And that is Matt and Chaylin. They're getting ready to leave soon too. The Old Blue Chair is the name of their boat. And there's our pattern that looks like we're drunk. We just woke up. I don't think we're drunk. Anyway, there you have it. We are headed to Virginia and to the marina to leave our boat for a few days while we visit some friends in Suffolk, Virginia. So, you might get a little more before we take off on our few days. We'll see. A little view of ahead of us with a little bit of morning fog. There was some morning rain. And there's a little bit of fog in here. There you have it from the Dismal Swamp. We're driving beside the highway. That's I-17, right on the other side of those trees. Of course, there was a bunch of traffic. Now it's not going. Let's see. Come on, cars. I can hear them. I don't see them. Anyway, that's just my luck. Oh, there's some. All right, y'all, we're crossing the Virginia line. Yeah. Coming into Virginia. All right, I gotta take a picture. We just passed a sign that said Dismal Swamp National wildlife refuge so I guess this is the area where there's a lot of wildlife like the rest didn't have wildlife <laughs> anyways let's see if I can find anything just an update we are still on the dismal swamp here in Virginia and I don't I think we have too much farther to go we should be coming up on another lock soon and after the lock we'll be right at the end of the dismal swamp and headed to the marina to drop off our boat I'm going to put it on video again and I'm going to be quiet so you can hear the sounds of nature. Something big, big log in the water that we got to go around, easing by. Ooh, boy. Ay, ay. Ah. Let's try that again with the sounds of nature. We had a big log in front of us. All right, I'm going to be quiet.
obstacles in the water. Update, we're still in the dismal swamp. I think we have like about 15 miles and I should be looking for my next sign at the 15 marker. Looks like maybe a couple of kayakers that we're coming up on. If so, that would be the first sign of human life form that we've seen other than our friends behind us and they're quite a ways back. Coming up on several kayaks today. Looks like several of them are fishing, maybe all of them. I hope they move because we certainly can't stop. You can see the tops of houses over there and hear the cars on the road. We're back in the hood. <laughs> We're back in, I can't think of the word I'm trying to say. We are tied off at the bridge wall and are waiting for the bridge um, tender. He's also the dock master to get a different boat going south through the lock and bridge and then he'll get us through. So we're just tied off waiting and the old blue chair is coming and they're going to tie off to us and we'll just wait until it's our turn. Here's the old blue chair coming. All right, here comes the boat that was in the lock and now we're getting ready to go through. Going through the bridge. Hello. Hi, how are you doing? Good. How are you? What? I said I'll see you All right. We'll see, see ya. you. Following Matt and Chalen to the lock. Caution. The bridge tender is also the dock master, I said that. So he's putting the bridge down and then getting in his car and driving down to the lock. So we're gonna get secured to the lock while we're waiting on him. And we should be dropping in this lock. So we went up eight feet at the last one. We should be going down about eight feet at this one. So the lock is straight ahead and I'm going to have to put my phone down in a minute so that I can do what I need to do. Stay that way.
he's barking orders at me. Anyways, I'm going to try and do this in the lock and see if it'll work. Unless he starts barking at me too much. Then I fly off the handle and then it won't work. <laughs> Just saying, these things are a very trying thing when you're on a boat. All right, I'm going to switch it. All right, he's headed to the gate to open it. We're gonna go about eight to 10 feet down. <laughs> oh, darn it. He said the eagle is down here, Mark. He said the eagle. Okay, our water is dropping. Mark. He gets on to me, but he's sitting there and he's not even paying attention. If my phone goes all over the place, it's because I need to pay attention to where my rope is as we're dropping. So anyway. We're dropping. Hey, Mark. Do we need to let go just a little bit? The ball is rising in the middle. Am I too tight or you? There, it's dropping. Matt and Jalen up there. Thank you. All right. Have a good day. He's giving you a... to Norfolk. So the old blue chair is headed which direction? North. They're going north and we're going south. We just said our goodbyes until we see each other next time. And I'm going to shut off this radio. Mark got it. Going through our Baya Marina that has a lot of sailboats up on the hard. Some other boats up there too. Sailboat, cool change. Chesapeake yachts. Passing by a rock quarry here in Virginia, Chesapeake. 
We're in Chesapeake, Virginia. <laughs> We're at the Commonwealth Brewery and it's pouring. Thank you so much, and thank you Top Rack for watching over our boat. 